Well, hello guys. Um, um this is uh, yeah, part four of uh, my Red Dead Redemption playthrough. Um, yeah. Well, we've um started a ruckus in town. The saloon's still closed, as you can. As you can see, there's lots of blood everywhere. Yeah. Well, guys, I think I think we shall. Let's um. Let's uh. Let's give Kieran a little um. A little visit. Who's this guy? I hope you're not here to cause more <coughs> trouble. What the hell is my horse doing? I hear poor Tommy is in quite a bad way. Oh. Hello, Hello sir. Hello. I told you was a guy I bet up by the I'm just trying to help where I can, sir. Or interfere. <coughs> you would have killed that man. What I do is none of your damn business, okay? Okay, okay. <coughs> okay, sir. <coughs> <laughs> this guy's not really sounding so well. Let's try and help each other. It's not about survival of the fittest. Yes, it is. Try, try, survive, yada, yada. Thank you. Wow. Yeah, me neither. I'll do the. You know what? You know what I'm gonna do actually right now. I'm gonna go get Emmett Granger. Flip. See, see, you guys. This guy's Emmett Granger. It's a gunslinger. Oh, he's a pervert. I never knew Emmett Granger was um, that weird. You know what? Let's... Yeah, no. He does. He done weird stuff to hogs. Apparently. Yeah, it's really strange. I don't know. Um... That is mighty strange. Come on, boy. I don't even know what I need my horse. Mm -hmm. And also, guys, once the saloon is open again, um, I'll get to the barber and uh, you'll see what I do. Yes, exactly. I don't know if you can hear earlier or not, but he said that I'm gonna turn myself into Walter White, which, um, <clears throat> yeah, I think Arthur looks good bald. He looks like a menace to society. Oh! Oh! Um. Is this is this guy dead? Yeah, this guy is dead. Um. Oh. Yep. I know he takes them. Yeah. He, oh. He did low honor as well. Well, I just had to brush my horse there because, like, my horse got very dirty, and that's um, that's a person who digs up animal bones. I, I, I can't be bothered um, doing the cutscene, I'll come back later. Yeah, yeah, well, I pushed past that. I'm gonna go to Emmett Granger first, and then I'm gonna go to Reverend Swanson, I reckon. Because it's right next to Emmett Granger. Yeah. 
Hey, I sell, I sold Sadie's horse. Emmett Granger! Hey, you! What do you want? Howdy. You mm -hmm. Granger? That's my name. And my occupation, too, if you hadn't noticed. Weren't always like that, though, were you? Used to be a quick draw so. guy. You knew Jim Boy Calloway? Used to be is correct. Them days are long over. And who might you be? Don't matter. I need you to tell me about Jim Boy. Just a quote for a book. A book of Just a Jim quote. Boy? <laughs> well, shit. I can't talk to you now. Look at me. A knee deep in hog crap. You don't mind me. Hmm. We can talk while you're Knee talking. deep in hog crap. <laughs> I ain't talking and shoveling. Besides, young man like you would get it done in half the time. I don't know about that. What's to know? You interested in the old days? You shovel this shit, I tell you some stories. You keep your hands clean, I don't give you squat. Oh, sure, you little bastard. These better be some stories. Exactly, that's what I'm thinking. Pick up the fork and get to work. Or get out of here and stop wasting my time. All right, shovel your damn shit. Jim Boy weren't nothing, you know. Me? I killed men. I can't believe. Animals, I even killed rocks, and I killed them good. I shot folks, stabbed folks, skinned folks. I scalped some. Boy, they scream when you scalp them. Hey, let me work. Uh, this shit is really high quality. I don't like it. No, I don't like how high definition the shit is. One time, I get it, all right? You're me. What about Callaway? Now it's clean enough to eat off. I guess I'm done. Get that barrel to the shit pile, and I suppose you is. Suppose you are. No shortage of shit down here. Is there not? Some hungry hogs and no hands. Mm-hmm. Hell, Ugh. that stinks. <laughs> okay, I clean up your mess. Go on, tell me about Callaway. Okay then. I tell you stories. I didn't say they'd be about him. Don't trifle with me, old man. You knew him. Just give me something, anything. You making a book? You should make it about me. They're just words, is all. Give me something to say, and I'll leave you alone. You owe me that. Hey, you be careful. <sighs> Killer like me, it don't take much to end up on the end of my knife. One hey, time. You know I... what? I don't think you were anything at all. Just a crazy old man. Exactly, I... crazy old man. It's hard to be hog feed. I hadn't made a deal with the federals. Got this far. This is your last chance, Mr. Granger. Two. Give me a quote from the book. Hey, hey you don't you want no man to peace. Don't mm -hmm. come in witness. <laughs> I have to record all of it. Said you was I've not been on all day to day. Tell me the half of it. I'm itching to drop you, girlie. Only wait worth my time. I, I got too much to lose. Too much to lose? Well, mm. seeing as I cleaned up this pig's die, I figure I'm in my rights to wreck it. Exactly, that's what I'm thinking. You walk away right now. Well, well. All I wanted was a quote. You don't know who you're trifling with. That's my stick. Is it now? Nah, yeah, you know, I'm just gonna see what go. happens to my owner. No. <laughs> you took yourself a regular shit sour. <laughs> you just took yourself a regular shit shower, Mr. Granger. Boy, that's real nasty. You earned yourself a killer. And I'm gonna enjoy it now. Draw. It's gonna be the last thing you do. <laughs> right, that's gonna be embarrassing if I uh, mess the draw up. Or do your your badass.
I ought to get a little picture. Wait, let me let me get up close to the face. Granger's revolver. Ooh, is this a cowman? A lit Granger. Let me see Granger's custom cowman. It's quite a cool cowman. It's quite a small cowman. Well, guys, I guess we'll go help Reverend now. Yeah. It's only uh, four minutes past eleven. That's a train, and I just killed some of my horse. Reverend. Advice, sir. I took your advice. Then your God has finally deserted you. What you talking about? I took your advice, sir. I have removed myself from Morpheus's embrace. No more shall I sink, sir. I am free. I am free. You don't seem free, friend. You seem drunk. Sit down, Reverend. We ain't finished. Mm. You ain't finished. Look at him, he's finished. None of us forced liquor down his throat, friend. I just want him to play. Now, firstly, we ain't friends. Don't make no mistake on that subject. Now, secondly, he can't hardly see, let alone reason. Now, reasoning ain't never been one of my strong points, neither. But seeing, but seeing I, I just do fine. You want to step outside or deal with business here? I just want him to finish the game. Why can't we all just get along? These are good men, Arthur. They're children of God. They are children of God. How's about you playing this place, huh? That seems fair. Fair? Sure. You want a game? You know what? Nah. I can't, partners. I don't mean to spoil your fun, but I got things to do. You sure? Quite sure. I gotta get him out of here. Come on, Reverend, let's get you <laughs> home. Where'd he go? I don't know. I was talking to you. <sighs> Gentlemen. Gentlemen. Reverend. Reverend. Reverend Swanson. Where'd you go? Excuse me. I'm sorry. You, you see a drunken idiot, a priest, wandering about? Sure. We saw him. Smelt him and avoided him. <laughs> he went that way, I think. Thanks. Guy looked kind of crazy, mister. Well, you have no idea. Reverend! Oh, this guy's a strong guy. Stop right there! Stay away from me! Oh, 
Stop, or I'll kill you. I swear. I said stop, damn it. Okay, okay. Please, don't hurt me. Back there? You're a dead man. You understand me? Hey, think about this. Yep. I I won't tell us so. I promise. Good. Get the hell out of here. Reverend. <sighs> now what? Where's Reverend? Why the hell is he going on the train tracks? Reverend. Oh my gosh, stupid reverend. Yep. Come on, my friend. It's just a simple mistake. You can still be saved. <coughs> you can still be saved. Oh my god. Oh shut up, Reverend. Jesus Christ. That's a fast train. That was a close one. Oh. What the hell's wrong with you? With you throwing me off a bridge like there that? There was a goddamn train, you crazy bastard! Have I been bad again, Mr. Morgan? I'm sorry. I, I wish I was different. Oh, shut up, Reverend. Let's get you home. Hold yes, let's get you home. That's a wonderful idea. Mm-hmm. Margaret. Margaret, who's Margaret? But Oh my god, Reverend. Are you talking about this in real life? Yeah. Huh? Ah. There, boy. Let's go see. Jamie and infantry. Hmm. Uh, uh. Apala. He's a para. One of the paras. Yeah, that's what I'm seeing. Para. Para. He's one of the paras. Close the drapes. Well, we're back. And we have stupid reverend here. What the hell is that music, Dutch? I'm going to do that one last. Yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> you better sleep your way to salvation, my friend. Oh, what happened? Just the yeah. usual. Poor bastard. Exactly. Well, thank you, Mr. Morgan. I'll keep an eye on him. He was lucky. 
this time. Real lucky. Yes, real lucky. You know what? I'm gonna contribute! I'm gonna give some gang this some money. Give an atom. Let's see. I'll donate seven dollars. Fourteen dollars. You know what? I'm gonna keep Arthur's beard like that now. Hello, Dutch. You know what? I'll give him the goatee right now. Right, he's got his goatee now. You know what, we're gonna do Arthur's normal outfit. Alright. Let's go see what Kieran wants. Hey Arthur. Yeah. To them. To Dutch. Speak! Don't cry, boy. Speak about your gang. Why can you not? Boy. Whoa! Hold your horses there. It seems the uh, cat has got our friend here's tongue. I mm -hmm. was Mr. Williamson could have a word. You ready to talk, boy? I told you, mister. I told all of you. I don't know nothing, okay? They ain't no friends of mine. Are they not? I've ridden with them for a while. Oh, shit. You see, we heard that part, so how about you tell the truth? That's what you want me to do. Hurt him, so the next time he opens his mouth, he needs <laughs> to tell us what is going on. Ah, who am I kidding? One of O'Driscoll's boys couldn't open his mouth, but he'd tell a lie. Screw it. Let's just have some fun. Huh? Geld him. Oh, yeah. <laughs> What's he doing? Where's he going? Oh, don't worry. You're only balls, boy. Just gonna cause you trouble. <laughs> you know, in Oh, no. Unix was among the happiest and most loyal of courtiers. No, you're kidding me, right? A court. You sick bastards! The gelding tongues. Well, you are gonna talk. The only question. <laughs> I love the Gelding Tongues. Okay, okay, listen. That's why Bill's gay. Driscoll's hold up, and you're right. He don't like you any more than you. Like. <coughs> He's at Six Point Cabin. Uh, I'll take you there. Serious, I don't like him. I mean, I like him even less than I like you. No oh, those Gelding Tongues are balling. Why don't you take a few of us up there? Right now. <laughs> no. I got this, Dutch. The first. golden tongues are on fire. Let's go. <laughs> <Gilded. laughs> Let's both hope you ain't trying to trick us, O'Driscoll. If he is trying to trick us, I'm gonna kill. Shit was. John, Bill, come here. We got a social call needs making. Where are we heading? Uh... We're up into the hills behind Valentine. Uh, well, I'll show you. John, you take this little rattlesnake with you. Any nonsense, you kill him. Sure. You're gonna pay your buddies our respects. Yes. He taking us to Cole? That's what he says. Come on. I'm taking you to him. 
Look, I I'll give you more directions when we're close. But if I know where we are, it's up past Valentine. All right, I'll lead. Yes, you lead, Marson. Sharing saddle with an old Driscoll. Who'd have thought? How many times I gotta say? Can we hurry up, John? You sure look like one, and you smell like. God damn. You smell like one too. I smell like horse shit. That's right. Boy, Boy you are. Morgan, you got throwing knives in your saddlebags. Doug said that you might. Huh? I was asked to give them. And I'm doing okay, wait a second, guys. I'll be back. Sorry about that. Next time you want to give me something, oh. how about you give it to me? Instead of hiding mean? it somewhere, hoping the opportunity comes oh. up to mention it. Oh. You're doing the poker. I didn't, I didn't do the poker. Hey, if I got my bearings, it's over here. Hmm. Yeah, I know this country. Take this track up through the rocks. Fine. Now we hold it's on. Right, but I'm fine. You damn well should be after all that bed mm -hmm. hey, all right. I need to get a better horse. Let me up. You know her. She won't be reasoned with. Well, when you was having a Blast. behind your Oh dear. We were getting shot at. And I'd do the same for you. If you was in a bad way. I hope so. But I fear you don't know how to help anyone. Except in yourself. You see, old Driscoll? If this is how he treats his friends, imagine what, what he treats. <laughs> I got an inkling of what y'all do to your enemies when you put those gelding tongs to my parts. <laughs> Bill, you still got those tongs? I got a knife. Won't be so clean, but it'll do the job. Keep that in your mind. Feller, right at the forefront of it. Now we go left. The uh, road will take us up and round. Are you sure about that, old Driscoll? Because we seem to be going in circles. Those are the hills. What are you going to do? Save your horses. We got to climb, boys. You know, you all ain't that different from the old Driscolls. What did you just say? I've been watching you all these weeks, and, uh... You've been tied to a tree. You don't know nothing about this gang. Yeah, well, I'd, I'd say you don't know much about the old Driscolls. But maybe I know more about you than you know about them. And I know all about them, so... <laughs> Tell us then. How are we like those mongrel dogs? You're outlawed like them. You're out to survive like them. Way. You live rough. You live hard. Fighting the law, nature. You're out for yourself. See, this is why you're an O'Driscoll, O'Driscoll. You're out to survive. We're out to live, free. Cohen's a Yay. thief and a killer. Dutch is Dutch is more like a teacher. Mm -hmm. Where I've been, you just look the same as all. 
Okay, now, now cut left up here. We, we go down the hill into the forest. Oh. Going in quiet. Taking them out as we find them. Trying not to set things off. Yeah. But if we do, we move quick and hard. We settle this like we know how, okay? What was that, huh? Okay by me. With you, Morgan. All right then. No, no. Through the trees here. Oh, sorry, boy. Come on, boy. Hey, we're real close. I'd leave your horses the other side of this clearing. I'll get my guns off my horse, and I'm ready. Easy, Bill. Quiet. Mm-hmm. So... This is it. The cabin's just the other side of this hill. Okay. Off your horses. Let's go. You gonna get them knives? I do have my knives. I said easy. Whoa! Follow me. Our... It ain't far. We might have shared a horse, but we ain't friends. Remember, I'm watching you every moment. I ain't gonna shop you now. Come on. It'd be suicide. You'll die, boy. <laughs> but you'll lose your balls first. Jesus Christ. Hey. Wait. I look die, Jack. Okay. Get down. Cabin's in the clearing down there. There'll be a bunch of fellers hiding out there too. Who? Armed. Armed? Drunk? Where are you strangers? Yup. And Colm O'Driscoll? Oh, he'll be holed up in his cabin. Be passed out, booze blind, likely as not. And over there, someone's coming. So, uh, who's gonna tell him we got nothing for the pot? Oh, let me think. Pot. The fellow that spooked the game, I reckon. I'm gonna drain it. I I'll catch up. No, we ain't gonna fall for that. We're gonna wait so you can tell him yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If anyone's actually gonna shoot the messenger, it'd be that mean son of a bitch. Mm, yes, yeah, sir. Come on, shake it off. <laughs> what are we doing about the pisser, Morgan? Oh, dude. The tree. I'm gonna deal with this first fella. Okay, go to work. Yeah, sorry, I was just deciding what to do. The old man loses it. I won't get another chance in ages. I'll be stood guard. Oh, crap. Shit. Sorry, that was my bad. I can't see. See combs in the cabin. Uh, 
Oh. You all right? Sure. Thank you. Come on, Driscoll. He's near here. You set us up. Come here. What? You set us up. No, I didn't. You did. Come on, Driscoll ain't here. He was here. I swear. I swear. I mean, if I was setting you up, I, I wouldn't have <laughs> saved your life. It's a good point, Arthur. Hmm. I've got my eye on you. I won't kill you. I didn't set you up. You're lost. Shit, lost. I'm letting you run away. Now go on. Get out of here. That's as good as killing me. Out there. Without you, Como just was gonna lose his mind about this. So? So I'm one of you now. <sighs> Give me a break. Give me a break. But I'm warning you. Oh, hey, I know. Come on, let's get to camp. So you got the cash then? What cash? Yeah, there's usually some cash in the chimney. I'll check it. Rest of you boys, get to camp quick. See, Arthur? Yeah, I ain't mm -hmm. so bad. Hey, Bill. You tell Dutch old Karen ain't worth killing just yet. <laughs> right <laughs> I took your advice. We well, said usually in the chimney, but I'm gonna check all the stuff. There's a ton of money clips everywhere, you know what I mean? Ooh, thirteen dollars. I'm never gonna have enough for a raffle. I've got enough for a raffle now. Is that a oh that's a shotgun? Mm, double barrel shotgun. Clean the shotgun, obviously. That was a dirty shotgun. Right, chimney. Right, is there any money in the chimney? Six hundred dollars. That will do. Right, let's go quickly before comb comes. Where should we go now? Please say the saloon's open. Yes! The saloon's open! Guys, we're gonna get the... the bold cut. Oh, Jesus. Wrong way. Stupid wolves. I bound things quite beautiful town, I think. A saloon. Hello. I'll tell you. Don't think I've seen you around here before. So play Hey, uh, Styles. All them red skins. Bold. I tell you. I wouldn't watch my family freeze to death in the winter of 72. If I'd known. Known about it, you wretches. And facial hair. Phil Styles. The goatee. If I can find it, yeah. Two 
Russian styles. Alright. Thank you. Mmm, your pizza. Thank you for the whiskey, friend. Oh. Ooh, hell you. So you here for the auction? I'm tired of looking at you, Quentin. You little shit. Not now, John, please. Now that right there, what are you on about? Oh! Not as much fun as you thought, you dumb bastard! Come on now, enough, John. It ain't necessary. Can't believe it. Time we dropped you for good. Sheriff! Stop, sir! This is beyond belief. That's it. Sheriff, help. Kill him, Sheriff. Sheriff! 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 Keep it civil, all right? Yes. I'm watching you. Don't think I ain't. Buy your things. Well, I'm sorry, guys, about that, but he was just being a meanie. Alright. Let's see. Oh, the military scout hat. This would be good. An Arthur hat. Let me know. I ain't gonna stay patient forever. Get down to business. A Walter White hat. Trying to find one. Hey, Dutchies. Yeah. Yeah, right. I'll get, I'll get the... I got things to tend to, so get on with it. Yeah, no. This one. Thank you, Candy. Wardrobe. Coats, duster. Don't really like that coat. You know, I have no coat vest. No vest, shirt. Ah, uh, no, 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 not right now. Let's find suspenders. Cotton's fine. Neckwear. I'll wear nothing. Gloves. Craft. I'll have no gloves. Ah, Arthur's got some hairy arms. I think that's it. Make it quick. We're shutting down. Okay then. Thanks, sir. 
Ja. Yes, we have to cook. <laughs> Hello, can I buy some papers? Thank you. Next time. Let's see what's in this paper. Train robbed. Pitch battles leaves many dead. Read. Private train owned by railroad sugar and oil. It was robbed in the broad daylight, but my outlaws heading off towards the Grizzlies. That was us. Hmm. Alright, let's go get this raffle. Out of the way. My oh my god. You know what? I'm gonna have a bath and book myself a hotel room. Yes. I got someone warming it up for you already. Just Thank get you. The corridor there. <laughs> ah, bad. Hmm. <laughs> Arthur Morgan. In a bath. Scrub it up, dub it up, dub it up, do. Scrub. No, I'm not. I'm not paying fifty cents for an extra bath. Then, yes. Scrub my arms, do but it do. Scrub my arms, that's what I do. Scrub my legs, leggy legs. I've got some dirty legs and scrubbing my bald hair. I might have some wine. Getting out the bath, I've got soap all over me. Over me, all over me. You better have left your troublemaking ways behind you. Hey, you mind your damn step. I'm sorry there. Cool. Need another night? No, oh, it's uh you. Yes, it is. Last time I checked. I I really don't need any more trouble. I didn't come to make any. I was just protecting a lady. Yes. Well, all behind us now, I suppose. So what is it you need? A, a bath, perhaps? No, I had a room. Thank you kindly for the room. Here's some nice bird meat. Nice view. Sleep. Morning. Only four hours. Only four hours. No, 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 no journal entry. Oh, that's black water. Wait, is it raining? Oh, I need to get a coat on.
Make a candle serve for the room. The hell you's going to? Do, 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 do. What a beautiful morning. Morning, Good morning. Good morning. Good to see you again, partner. What can I do for you? I think so. <laughs> $120 for a Springfield raffle. Springfield raffle has been bought. Components. I search. Bet you could use some rifling on this thing. Improve search. It's a nice piece and all, but personally add some rifling. Take it or leave it. Uh barrel. Rifling. $20. I'm fine. Styles, medals. I'd like to give this a personal touch with some engraving. Hmm. Trigger. Hmm. Huh. Well, thank you very much. Oh, wait. You're that fellow who had to fight with Tommy outside of Smithfields? Yes. Yep. People are still talking about that fight. I ain't. Well, fair enough. Now there's Tommy. Anyway, how can I help you today? I mean, I just, you just, um... Give me a gun. Thank you. Be some mistake. Oh, that was a bit. Look here. Maybe this is our man. You a bounty hunter, mister? Maybe. It depends. But I'm guessing you ain't here to pass the day, turn yourself in, or discuss the finer points of county law. Then I don't need to know much more than that until I got a reason to. All right. You smell that? Mm-hmm, I do smell that. Livestock town, mister. Attracts delinquents and reprobates like flies. Now, I'm not a fellow to pass a quick judgment, but I've been around long enough to know you don't hire a saint to catch a sinner. You bring me what I need, and I'll pay you well. Thank you. Don't ask no questions. I will do it. So, what is it you need? Why don't you have a look at that poster on the wall over there? Hmm. Slow down, Huckster. He's been poisoning folks with his miracle cure from Oh, here. damn, that's a bit nasty. Rickets without even pulling a trigger. Get some kind of sick satisfaction out of it. Filler over at the saloon says he thought he saw him by the gourd straight. Fifty dollars. You think you can bring him in? What's his name? That's good. I need him alive, though. Oh, well, I, I want to make sure the women he witted get compensated before he swings. I'll see what I can do. Well, good luck to you. Yes, I'll see what I can do. With my new rifle. That's an important point. Alive. I got it. Hmm. Benedict. Oh, bright. Okay, then. Oh Jesus, we got five minutes. Yeah, okay, right, we'll probably get halfway through this and I'll just have to automatically stop. Yeah, that's it, boy. Yeah. Yeah, good boy. 
I've only got four shots. I'm doing the bounty right now because I have to do it quickly. Yeah. Let's go for five minutes. Heading over. Come. We better go quickly because. Guys, we not got long left. Here's a failure. Uh, what we got here? Are you Benedict Albright? Benedict Albright. Huh. Kinda look like him. And I was told he'd be up here. No, uh, not me, sir. It's because. I want to buy some medicine, and I've heard, <laughs> I heard good things. I'll pay and go if you could help me find him. It's just my mother's real sick. Oh, well, if that's the case, for a sick woman, I'd be happy to help. <laughs> I'm a healer, you know, a medical man. Finest medicine in the state. <laughs> <laughs> Game's over, mister. Put your hands up. Taking you out. Taking me in? What for? Apparently that stuff you're pushing is killing folk. And there's a price on your head. I don't know. It ain't my business. My partner, that's crap. I'm a healer. What do you mean that's crap? I got an aura. I speak to spirits. That I'm a scientist. Folks get real angry for no good reason. This... This is a mistake. Keep your hands up, buddy. They only want you for questioning. I have to insist that this is a mistake. Don't be a fool. Oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God, I nearly lost you. Oh, oh, you saved me. Now, come on, buddy. Let's make this easy. What, you're taking me in? It's just for question. Oh, hey, you saved my life. Ain't we had enough drama? I, I, I'd be better off jumping. Uh, they expressly told me not to kill you. What? Oh, this is about you. Uh, Don't jump. Uh, oh, oh, what? You can't shoot me, do I? Please. I'll take my chance. Come here. How about free? <laughs> hey, no, I don't believe. Oh, my God, stupid Benedict. Dun, 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 dun. Swim to the air. Uh, grab all of something. Oh, grab all of something. All right. Look out, the rapids. Hold your breath. Jesus Christ, he's going fast. I got you. Come here. Come here. What do you mean? Bye, Bandit. Well, guys. Seems it's going to end right there. I'll see you guys in the next 